Hi friends, welcome to Beautifully Bookish Bethany. Today I have some very fun and exciting announcements for you. I've got some updates to give you. So we're just gonna do a little bit of channel housekeeping in this video. It's gonna be short and sweet, stay tuned. First, the big announcement, I've been hyping this on social media. For those of you who don't already know, patrons already got a sneak peek, but I promised you Haunted Ring Light merch and it is here. You are getting Haunted Ring Light merch. I love this so much. I worked with an artist and what she came up with is perfect, incredible, and I adore it. I hope you like it as much as I do. I think it's really fun. So this is it. This is the Haunted Ring Light merch image that is now available in my merch shop. You can put it on a sweatshirt or a t-shirt or a bag or a hat or a mug or whatever. There's like lots of things. So if you want some fun Haunted Ring Light merch, it is available now. You can go and purchase it. I just think it's really fun. Just in time for spooky season and Halloween. And if you order, I think in the next five days, you get free shipping on your order, which is very nice. So if you want to go and check it out, get free shipping, you can use the links down below to go and do that. So ta-da, it's here and I love it. I'm obsessed. I ordered myself a couple of things with it on it. I think it's hilarious. For anybody who's new here, we have kind of a running joke that I have a haunted ring light because when it's hot out, it like sometimes changes colors randomly. Um, and so there you go. You have your haunted ring light merch just in time for Halloween if you want it. That said, I also have a fun exclusive thing using the Haunted Ring Light merch image for patrons, and I have a special offer running through the end of October. So for any new existing or upgrading patrons who are patrons as of October 1st, they are gonna get this postcard in the mail. I think it's really cute and really fun. I'm excited about it. So I'm having these printed. They will be personally addressed and mailed out. This is open internationally. I can pretty easily mail postcards internationally. So if you want one of these postcards from me with this cute haunted ring light merch image on it, consider joining me on Patreon. The links are down below. As an added benefit, anybody who is new or upgrading by at least a dollar, I'm gonna be running a thing where you can get personalized book recommendations in a forthcoming patron only live stream. So that's exciting. I don't do a huge push for Patreon very often, but about once a year I'll do something like this, which is fun because I get to send perks to the people who've been supporting me and also offer something fun for new incoming people. And I would just say that for the last five years, I have been creating content around books pretty much full-time as my full-time job. So if you are financially able and you appreciate and like the content that I'm creating, consider supporting me on Patreon. It really does make a huge difference. If you're unable to, of course, just watching my videos, commenting, interacting, etc., is great too. But if you're able and if it's something that you value, maybe consider it. There are also some fun added perks. We do our monthly book club, which you probably hear about in my TBR videos every month. And for anyone who is wondering, I'll go over our book club picks for the rest of the year. We do vote a few months out to make sure that anybody who needs to get a library request in or needs to plan ahead for their TBR has plenty of advance notice. Patrons do get to vote on books, but I try not to do anything super last minute for those reasons because I want to make sure everybody who wants to participate can participate. That said, it is currently September. Our book club pick for this month is The Left Hand of Darkness by Ursula K. Le Guin. This is a modern classic of science fiction, and I'm very excited to read it and discuss it at the end of the month. For October, we're going to be reading The Hollow Places by T. Kingfisher. This is a horror novel with kind of a portal fantasy element to it, from what I understand. I've enjoyed some of what I've read from T. Kingfisher, and I've heard good things about this one. Then November and December are going to be more romance heavy. For November, we're reading Trick by by Natalia Jaster. It is a indie published fantasy romance that will be available on Kindle Unlimited. And then in December, we're going to be reading a more actually, this is an anthology of holiday short story romances written by a group of Latinx authors, some of whom I really like. So I'm excited for this. I think they're also meant to be intersecting stories that are all surrounding a Noche Buena party the night before Christmas. So I think that's going to be really fun. So for anybody who joins in September, you're going to be a part of helping make decisions about what we're going to be reading in January of next year. Oh, and one other thing that is newly available as of last year, not necessary, of course, but some people do take advantage of it 
if you know you want to commit to my Patreon for an entire year, you can pay up front and you get an 8% discount. So it takes off 8% of the cost for a year if you pay like in bulk. So if that's something that is of interest to you, it is available to you. Again, all the links are down below. I'm like reading my notes. Like what else do I, oh, 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 okay. Last thing I wanted to announce about the Patreon for next year, because I'm excited. This is the time of year where I send out a satisfaction survey to my patrons to get a sense of what's working, what's not working, whether I want to tweak anything for the coming year. And based on those survey results, I'm not making any major changes this year. There's going to be a few tweaks and there'll be a video going up on Patreon that'll go through all the details of that. But one thing that I wanted to announce here that I think is going to be really fun is we're going to do one, maybe two little patron only readathons next year, which I'm excited about. So starting in January, I am bringing back for those who've been around for a few years, uh, a patron version of the Get Shit Done readathon. I think like the last two weeks of January that's about just kind of getting a good fresh start to the year with your reading and getting to things you've been meaning to read. So I think it's going to be really fun. And then I've had some requests to maybe do a manga readathon later next year. So maybe mid to late 2023 we'll be doing something like that. So lots of fun things coming. I like doing sneak peeks of things I'm working on and there, there's just a lot of fun stuff. So if you're interested, if it is financially viable for you, and if you want to support what I do, that is open to you. Again, no pressure. It's not something I do a hard sell on. And I really only talk to this level about it publicly about once a year. So here is my yearly thing for 2022. Talk to me in the comments down below. Let me know any of your thoughts. And uh, tell me if you are as excited about the Haunted Ring Light merch as I am. I love how it turned out. Seriously, the, it perfection. I'm so happy with it. If you guys like this video, it helps if you give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you want to see more. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.